But first, as temperatures continue to rise throughout the summer, there are things that people should be aware of if they're spending time outside. Thank you for joining us for 7 News at 6. I'm Steve Moore. And I'm Catherine Guyon. Heat exhaustion and heat stroke are two very serious illnesses. It's important, though, to know the difference between them. Heat stroke is a far more serious condition. Heat exhaustion symptoms include headaches, dizziness, nausea, and vomiting. For heat stroke, the body temperature continues to rise. You start having more neurological symptoms, which can lead to confusion, trouble walking, and even more serious symptoms like seizures or fainting. You want to stay out of the hot heat of the day between 10 and 10 a.m. and 2 p.m. You want to wear light clothes, a hat, adequately hydrate, avoid the alcohol, uh, stay in the shade, take breaks, take care of yourself. It's about prevention. He also says not to leave your pets or children inside of any hot cars or really hot areas. And speaking of